Hey y'all, so today we're going to be styling this frontal wig into a half up, half down pin curl bun with a bang. So yeah, let's just get straight into the video. I started out by sectioning the hair into two. I sectioned off just enough leave out for the back section to cover the wefts. And then I just clip that away while I'm taking my Nairobi styling mousse smoothing the hair down and then i'm going to braid away that back section so i started off with a freshly washed wig it is wet and so that's why i'm using my styling mousse So what you see me doing here is sectioning the bangs. I am a little bit of a perfectionist, as you can tell. I'm going to then add my Nairobi setting mousse, smooth it out, and then put that bangs into a pin curl. After doing that, you're going to see me separate the baby hairs just before smoothing out the ponytail section and clipping that up. So here is what your section should look like. You can put the wig under the dryer. I just let mine air dry overnight. I came back the next day with my sleek stick. And then you're going to see me smoothing all the sections out again with my hot comb. So after we get everything smoothed out with our hot comb, next we're going to start molding that ponytail. I started off with my Forever Renee Holding Spray. You're going to see me using a combination of my edge brush and the hot comb to smooth out the hair. Once I get the hair smoothed out in the place that I want it, then I'm going to use my blow dryer to seal it in and dry that holding spray um secondly you're going to see me use got to be spray as a second holding spray um just to get everything extra firm the forever renee holding spray is kind of a soft hold it adds a nice shine it's a really good holding spray but um i do like to just Add the extra security with that got to be spray and when i say this ponytail is extra secure it's going to have a very nice shine very nice hold you won't have to worry about any flyaways the ponytail coming apart like this hairstyle lasted me a good week and even after i took my wig out it still stayed in form so if you use this method it will turn out great <laughs> so yeah next we're going to just make sure that your ponytail is in the middle you don't want to have yours cricky like i got mine so yeah you see me fix that now and using that got to be once i got everything perfect then we're gonna start on the bang section
So for this part, I like to have my bang section kind of like swooped over and sitting up. So what you see me doing is brushing it into place with my edge brush. I did spray a little bit of Fantasia holding spray. It is a very strong spritz. So you don't want to spray it directly on the hair. You want to spray your edge brush, brush it into place, and, you know, use a combination of your hot comb or blow dryer and just get it how you want it. Once I have it to my liking, then you'll see me come in with my got to be spray and my blow dryer and set in that bang section. And when I say it stayed up like that all night, all week, I'm telling you guys, if you use this method, it will turn out great. I know I said that already, but I was just proud of how this wig turned out. So yeah, keep watching and stay tuned for the final product. So what you just saw me do was wrap some extra hair around the base of the ponytail. I secured it with some pins. You want to make sure the pins go up through the ponytail and not down through your wig because then it'll be uncomfortable. It doesn't matter if the base of the ponytail is wide because we are doing a bun. You just want to make sure that you have fullness to achieve that um, pin curl bun. So I um, curled the bang section, pinned it, add some setting spray, and use my hot tools to secure those flyaways. I use my um, Kenra styling spray throughout the curling process, and now you're just seeing me work on that bun. I curled it, pinned it, and you're just going to do that throughout. You want to make sure that you're using setting spray when you are curling that bun just to prevent those fryaways because you want this to look very neat. So you're going to see me using the setting spray and using the end of my comb to smooth out the flyaways, tuck them away. And I even did use my scissors to trim the flyaways as well. I decided to let some of the curls hang, give it a messy look. And so yeah, just watch how I achieve this bun. So while I'm doing that, I do wanna tell you guys a little bit about this unit. This is a machine made wig, customized by yours truly using extensions from my hairline, Deluxe Strands. I'm gonna put the Instagram on the screen. You can DM me, text me, or email me. I'm taking custom orders. Um, my website will be back up soon where you can purchase ready-made units. Um, you can shop for extensions, closures, frontals, great quality hair. And there is a shop tab on my Instagram page as well. So yeah, make sure you guys are following me. So lastly, after I finished the bun, I just curled the back section, which you'll see here in just a second. I'm also going to insert some videos of how it looked after I installed it. And a few days after the installation, the curls held up very nicely. The bun stayed intact. So yeah, I hope you try this style out. Thank you so much for watching. See you guys soon. Bye.